With Android Studio, it is possible to display the virtual device either as a separate application or as an integrated application inside Android Studio. So let's start this virtual device using this button, which is AVD Manager. Now let's click on this button to start the virtual device. Now we can close this window. And here, as you can see, the virtual device is a separate application that we can use with Android Studio. Now let's close it and let's see how we can integrate it into Android Studio. So to integrate this virtual device inside Android Studio, we have to go to File, then Settings, then in this window we have to click on Tools, then we have to click on Emulator, and here we have to check this box, it is Launch in a Tool window. Now let's click on OK, and now we can start the virtual device again, always using this button. Now let's click on this button to start the virtual device. And as you can see, the virtual device now is integrated into Android Studio. So we can use it with Android Studio to test our applications. Now if we want to stop this virtual device, we have just to click on this close button. And if we want to hide this area, we have to click on this button. So now if we want to modify the configuration and to start the virtual device as a separate application, we have always to go to File, then Settings, and here we have to click on Emulator, and we have to uncheck this box. Now let's save this configuration using this OK button. And let's start our virtual device again using AVD Manager. So let's click on this button to start the virtual device. And as you can see, now our virtual device is a separate application as initially. So this is all for this video. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to the channel.